Hello and welcome to Zentail. In this video, I will be showing you how to create a SKU using the user interface. To start off, you're going to go to your catalog, which you can do by clicking on the catalog button in the top right hand side. From there, you're going to click on the pencil mark in the bottom of your screen. You will now be taken to a page that says create product. Now you're going to have to enter in some of the information in these blank fields in order for your SKU to appear in your catalog. So as an example, I'm going to call this example 1. The smart type is something we'll talk about in a different video, but basically it will autofill once you add in the Amazon item type. So be sure to look that up before creating a new SKU. Is FBA is asking you if this SKU is an FBA SKU or an FBM. FBM refers to Merchant Fulfilled SKUs. Now you have to enter in the UPC. The majority of channels, apart from Amazon, currently require this field. Now this is just a test number. You're going to give your SKU a title. Let's call it video tutorial you can give it a brand or and MPN now certain fields aren't required but different channels have different requirements uh, as a standard we like to fill in SKU UPC you gotta mention if it's FBA or, or not uh, the title and brand is always good to have Let's see. And then I'll go into price and availability. You must have the price in order for this to be active. You can enter in a package weight. Sometimes you may see a error message that says, please enter the package weight. Now we'll go to category and description. This is where you would add in a description for your product. We have a what you see is what you get editor. You can bold text, italicize, underline, and have these preset sizes. You can add a number list and bullet points. You can enter tags to improve the searchability of your items on your different marketplaces. And you can enter in up to five bullet points. Now I believe Amazon requires at least one. As I mentioned before, the Amazon item type is something that is useful to add. Uh, this helps us create, categorize the SKU uh, by creating a smart type that will be specific to your item. For example, in, in this case, I could put something like scooters. And now the smart type should autofill or create a new one that says scooters. Our smart type is based on your Amazon item type and if you have it, the department. The smart type allows us to autofill in a lot of the other fields you see here. Over to media, you can add in an image by just hitting the plus button and you can choose any image from your computer. And finally, you click the check box at the bottom right corner. All right, now the product is saved. You see example one, the title. Right now it says auto stock because I don't have any inventory in it. Once I have inventory in it, I can start listing it on these channels that I'm integrated with. Let us know if you have any questions, and thanks for watching.